Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, I'm sorry I don't have the best setup. I'm currently on my Mac, but um, this video is to cover sound in Twine 1.4.2. Um, I had a lot of trouble finding out uh, how to get sound to play like continuously uh, through a project. Um, so hopefully this video helps you out. Uh, I'll put a link in the description. Uh, you want to go to this website and the first thing you want to do is click on this text document and you're going to copy all this, right? Just control A, command A if you're on a Mac like me. And you'll want to click and make a new script. Um, I have it right here. All it does is just tag uh, this twine thing with a script. You paste everything. You can call it whatever you want. And literally that's it. Um, you have some commands over here that tell you, you know, like if you want to play a sound, so play sound is obviously play sound. Uh, loop sound, that's the one I like because it loops everything. You can even get kind of fancy fade in, fade out. Um, and I'll show that real quick. So like right now I have the a, a song MP3 uh, looping, and it is worth to mention. Um, let me go to, sorry about this. So I have a folder on my desktop just called Twine. You want to store all your audio, you know, MP3 sounds in this folder um, because you do need to fully build in order to test the sound. Um, and yeah, it's pretty robust. You know, you can you can tell it to stop and then loop another sound. Um, so I'm going to shut up now and kind of give an example. So yeah, hope this all kind of helps you. Um, it's actually really easy once you know what you're doing, but it was kind of difficult to discover. So yeah, here we go. So yeah, you can see, pretty robust with sound, works really well. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will talk to you all later.